that the dry cow period is actually the most important period in a cow's life uh, because that success of lactation is actually de determined in the dry cow period and as if during the transition period, the last three weeks before calving until the three weeks after calving. In this farm, they have two dry cow groups, a far off group, which you see here. And actually, it's a very good solution because those far off dry cows, they're actually kept into a, a freestall barn. But to give them some more exercise, actually, they are being fed on the outside and they are fed a ration which is very, very fibrous, rich in fiber to actually stimulate rumen uh, function and to actually also maintain that rumen volume because that rumen volume will actually be under pressure in the last weeks and the last month before calving because that calf is growing very uh, big, uh, very quickly and actually the rumen needs to be filled up very well so those cows can eat a lot of feed also after calving. And you see that the, the ration is very fibrous and actually also very low in energy, which is excellent. Because we want to have those cows in a constant body condition during the dry period. The state they enter the dry period should also be the state that they have when they calf.